popping YouTube. This is Math Again Supreme Physique. What's really hood? Just out here chilling with the homie right here with my boy. Um, anywho, let's talk, man. Let's talk. Why don't you pull me one more time, bro? I swear up with you. Um, let's talk about it. Uh damn. Well, damn, I didn't see that. All right. Anyway, that's not what we hear about. Actually, that's exactly what we hear about. Mm -hmm. Look at this dog walking into the camera. Yeah. Anyways, so, quick little update what I've been through, dude, what I've been up to. I ain't talked to y'all in a minute. Look at this poopy face. Look at this face. Look at this face. Get out of here. Um, all right, dog, go. This one, go. Um, so, I've been doing a split. Like I, like I told you guys before, I was doing the, uh, the Christian Jones' is, um, uh, classic physique program. Hey, shut up. Gotta talk to him sometimes. Hold on. Watch me stop all this right now. Hold on, let me show y'all. Hey! Chill out. That's how you handle that. That's how you handle that. Um, it's a puppy. I hate puppies, man. I hate them. Um, give me all a sidetrack. Anyways, um, like I told you guys before, I was doing a classic physique program by Chris Jones. I bought that for a few reasons. One, he the, he a real one out here. I mean, obviously, plus it, he a real one. Everybody, if anybody that watched YouTube probably watches videos. And on top of that, um, I feel like... When I needed a program, I needed a program. I didn't need it, but I, I wanted a program. And then, um, like, it's, 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 I feel like it's unfair for me to not give him uh, give him a little bit of love because he taught me a lot of stuff, you know what I mean? So the least I could do is uh, buy his program and get gains, you know what I mean? It's like, help me, help you, help you, help me kind of thing. So I did that. I thought it was really cool. My deadlifts got on point. I think my back got a little bit wider. You know what I mean? Stuff like that. Um, but I actually have not even really checked my physique lately. I just been working out, working, eating this guap. You feel me? Money over muscle, money and muscle, stay on my hustle, Cali muscle. Um, but after I finished that program, I say the downside for me, I'll be real with y'all. Y'all rule me, I'll be real with y'all. Only downside with that is the program so similar that like it, it starts to get like you know not not repetitive but it doesn't really it doesn't excite me. I uh, people like the same thing over and over again. I like looking at my phone, look at the program. Like, oh, what are we gonna do differently today? You know what I mean? Instead of doing it over and over again. Um, so I got bored with it. It was cool. I got heck of games. I finished it up. I liked it. I did uh, my rows has got heavier. Like I, I could for sure for sure row three fifteen. That's dope to me. Uh, Bento rows is like uh, like a. Uh, it's like bench pressing me. That's one of my favorite exercises for back. Um, but so I got bored. I needed to do something else. I finished that one up. What I'm gonna do? I'm not gonna write nothing on my own because I won't do it if I write it on my own. So I went back to the old basics. I chose Chris Jones' um, program because it's a classic physique. But guess what? I already have the Cyclopedia, the Bodybuilding Encyclopedia, aka the Bodybuilding Bible. I put my hand on it every night. You know what I mean? Look at that. Um, <laughs> So, um, if you want classic physique, guess what that body, guess what that has in there? Classic physique programming, because that's what, that's what they're doing back in the day. So, I've been doing it. Uh, right now, my weight is currently at like 210 right now, 211. You know what I mean? So, I've been making stupid gains. I'm, I'm finishing up with the program. The, uh, the, let me show, let me show y'all. I'm, I'm talking that shit. Let me show y'all. Um, <laughs> All right, here we go. I had that bookmark. I had that Bart pass. Um, so, I'm going to show you guys what I've been on. I ain't going to show y'all, but I'm going to show y'all. Because I want y'all to take my word for it and then do everything I'm doing from here when y'all ain't bought the book. I mean, I want y'all I want y'all to get y'all gains. So, be be real. Just get the book. So, I've been on the mass program. Phase one. So, long story short... Um, the math uh, program is push pull legs, something that we all done before for the most part. I actually really like it because let me tell y'all why. Yeah, you know when you at the gym, say you're doing arms one day, your arms really swole, you got your tank top on, feeling good, mm, making gains. But the only thing that's pumped right now is your triceps. But let's get that push pull, let's get that uh, all push day, right? I'm doing all chest and triceps and shoulders. Now the whole upper body just looking swole. So now you walk around looking like a straight stud, straight demigod. You feel me? So now, um, I'll just slobber all over my book. Um, so that's how we like it. That's one reason I like about it. And then let's be honest, when you're doing, let's, if you want, let's keep the pump going. That's why I like to feel that. Keep that pump going. Um, so. What it was is Monday was push, Thursday, Tuesday was pull, Wednesday was legs, rest, rest, repeat. 
So the only downside was like the rest, rest. I feel like I didn't need enough. That's too much rest. My mind be tripping. I'd be like, I gotta do something. I gotta do something. So usually I do some type of whatever I feel like doing. Like for instance, say um, I'll play racquetball for an hour or two, whatever. Yeah, I'm kind of nice with the racquetball. No problem. Um, or I won't do anything. I just be chilling, whatever. But I really, I mean, the only downside of resting so much is I just get bored. I'm at work all day. Like, I got to do something. You know what I mean? I can't be just chilling in a brick while everybody else getting gains, getting clients by looking swole. So that kind of sucks. So it is what it is. Don't get me wrong. Some days I was like, mm, I'd, be, I'd be like, hold on. Not sore. Going at it again. You know what I mean? I'll do that a lot. So, um, so it's pretty cool. I like it. For the first, it, the, the reason why I like this so much, again, is because, um, every week it was something different. Like you, you'll be going to do the same workout, but the rep schemes is a little different. So it makes it kind of exciting. See if you can push that same way you did for that eight reps. We're going to do it again for the nine or 10, 12 reps, whatever. That's, that's one reason I like it so much. Cause again, every week is something different. I like that. That's all for me about programming. It's all about some, something different. Cause I remember when I first did Edgar's program, it was so cool. Cause I mean, his program philosophy is a lot different than like this book compared, uh, pretty much, um, very high reps, very high volume, which is dope to me. Um, but the downside with that was I was, I wasn't getting the strength that I was looking for. Keep in mind, my boys, you see Vince, that dude's a swole dude, Gerald, G, uh, G soul. These dudes are swole and they're strong. So like, I can't just be picking one thing and like, squeezing on muscles and, uh, getting all chiseled, but yet being weak as shit. So that's what my problem was. You know what I mean? Like, being that kind of strong dude at once and then like not as strong. I don't like that. I don't like what it feels, but I was looking for it though. Oh, oh my, dog. my dog in here. Watch this, let me, let me calm that down. Hey, 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 calm down. Got him. Nah, he'll probably do it again. But anyways, so that's how I liked it. Along down, I don't think we do cardio in this program. Arnold, did you do, did you do cardio? Because I don't see it in here. I could be tripping. I ain't read this book in a long time, but I don't see any cardio in here. If you want me to get cardio, because I'm not doing it, because you ain't got it on here, so I don't do it. You feel me? I don't think I got abs like that no more, because I don't do cardio no more. You feel me? Anyways, so uh, I'm going to finish. I think it's going to be my last week of push, uh, push, pull legs. I think that this is my 12 week, 12 rep week. So we'll see. Um, but then next week, I'm going to be starting the, uh, the phase two, not four, two. So this was a little bit different. This was, see, this is why I always, I got, when I was doing it before, it, it, it kind of threw me off like this. I was like, what? Huh? Let me tell you why is why. So you know how we're so used to uh, chest one day, back one day, blah, 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 single body part movements. Then you got push, pull legs. Now this one is combining, combining stuff that you don't even, don't really make sense to me. I don't, maybe I gotta read it and figure out why, but hey, if Arnold put his stamp of proof on here, if Arnold did that, it's for the real ones, you know what I mean? So let me tell you why it's weird. For next week's program, it's gonna be uh, hamstrings, I mean, sorry, uh, for day, day one, day one is gonna be back hamstrings and calves. Day two is gonna be shoulders, triceps, and abs. Day three is gonna be glutes, quads, and calves. Day four, chest, biceps, um, chest, biceps, and abs, rest, and repeat. All right, I'm gonna tell you some weird things about that. Number one, why is chest day on number four? You know we need our chest day on Monday. That's honorary chest day. I gotta get my chest day on that day. So that's kinda whack. Um, back and hamstrings, why? I don't know, but Arnold said it's good, so I'ma rock with Arnold on this one, you know what I mean? But number one, I know I'm gonna get gains from it. Ask me why. I'm going to tell you why. The reason why I know I'm going to engage from it because it's something different. My body's going to respond to a different way. You feel me? So that's going to be pretty cool. Um, all right, let me tell you. Oh, I am leaning back on them before I tell y'all. Let me tell y'all. All right. Um, <laughs> this is why it'd be weird. Let me tell y'all why. Let me, let me look y'all dead in the eye. So for the first day on back and hamstrings, they want me to do 40 reps on a wide grip. Pull up, chin ups. Wow, why? That's all I want to say. Wow, why? 40 reps. Wow, why? I can't do that. I can barely do 15, if that. So that's going to suck. But you know what I mean? If Arnold said do it, Arnold, pfft, it's the GOAT, man. I'm going to do it. No problem. Look at that. Damn, I'm kind of vascular. Just imagine if I cut a little bit. So yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. And then let's go to phase three. Let's go drive to the uh, phase three. Uh, phase three. Single body parts. This one we're going to be doing that chest, back. Oh, okay, okay. Hold on. When I get to phase three, actually, I'm going to tell y'all. Stay tuned. Learn about the, the phase three. Um, so right now, I'm, I'm looking pretty good right now. 
Hint y'all can see, I've been making some real gains lately. Shoulders been looking like I put work in. Triceps is on point. I ain't even got a pump yet. Let me get one quick flex one in. So, I'm putting work in, enough said. Um, what I've been doing different, I haven't been tracking my calories either. Uh, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna keep it. Y'all cool with me? I'm gonna be cool with y'all. So, usually, like, when I was not working as hard, uh, when I didn't have that many clients, I was getting all my meals in. Only downside now, I'm really working. <laughs> now, I'm getting all those meals in. So, I'll be knocking out like four to six meals every four to five meals a day. You know what I mean? Which apparently is working for me. You know what I mean? Before, I, I was eating like six or seven. Um, so, I'm putting. Oh, I ordered mine. I order, I ordered a necklace um, off a of line. And then, you know, when you order something that you really want, heck of bad, you'd be like, when, as soon as you hear a sound, you'd be like, is that, the, is that UPS? Are they here? Are they here, though? That ain't them pissed. That ain't them. So technically I was gonna leave to go to work <laughs> to go make some calls, get some more new clients, you know what I mean? But then I got a text message, I mean I got a uh, email from a uh, place where I ordered my necklace, like blink him. I looked at it, it's like it is now in Manteca. It's all in it, it's in route. So I'm thinking to myself, I could probably get it before I leave and go back to work looking all shiny and icy, you feel me? So we'll see. I'm gonna leave in like 30 minutes, whatever, who knows. But yeah, so my physique's looking pretty good right now. I'm actually really happy. Um what I need to do is bring up my legs right now. I'm gonna tell y'all why. Um, not cause my wet, not cause my legs is lagging. Like I'm, I ain't already putting that work in if y'all don't mind. But the problem is this. The problem is this. I don't got calves. <laughs> I don't got calves. I do them, but I only do them. <laughs> I don't got calves. So I've been wanting to rock some compression pants for a minute. You know, people wear those compression. They wear their uh, baseball, basketball shorts, and then they have ooh, get off my screen. Um, and they wear the compression pants underneath it, right? Those look dope. But I don't want to expose my weakness by putting them compression pants on my cows and I don't got them. So I'm on a mission with spy can vision. I'm trying to get some uh, calves now, man. I'm on I'm on a roll to calves. I know, uh, what's his name? Uh, what's his name? Uh, his name is Swole something. What is his name? No, Mr. No Neck. He, he doing that. I'm over here trying to bring them calves. Though. Let me show you. Let me see if I can show you. It's like I, I got a good calf leg. Y'all see that? Calf is whack. Just... Whack. All right. Anywho, I'm making the video way too long. Uh, this is Matthew again, Spring Physique. I, I, oh, my dogs is violent, man. They make sure we safe out here. Hold on. Let me, let me shut them up. Let me tell you how I shut them up. Tell them to move and close the door. It's gonna be a little dark in here. Watch out. I'm trying to get my necklace, cuz. It's got heck of dark in here. <laughs> just got super dark. But I gotta, um, before I close this out, I got a supplement review coming up. Y'all know I mostly, I only do, or for the most part, I always do supplement reviews on pre-workout because I'm addicted. I need it. No, I don't need it, but I need it. So, uh, stay tuned for that. This is Matthew Gann for Spring Physique. Oh, Dirty? Hey, Dumb Dog. Dumb Dog. We out.